people, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to defend the statue. While I am um, gonna respond to what people assume about me, and usually the viewers are the one to send assumptions, but I want to do it differently. I am gonna be responding to the most commonly assumed facts about me, and this is also a good opportunity to like, clear some things up because I feel like there's a lot of misconceptions about certain subjects and stay till the end because I will be responding to the most absurd but and most frequent assumption that has ever been assumed about me. Alright, um, let's go. Start to focus with doing this and trying to the assumptions at the same time because there's so many noobs going on. The first assumption that I get is, and this is actually pretty common, not just me, but the, like every YouTuber, is that if I say I'm gonna go on break, I'm like meeting forever, and that is not the case. Um, I feel like if I go on break, this is actually pretty common that people worry about how I'm feeling, and. Like yes, people have to be worried about like their favorite creator, but sometimes it's just like maybe a bit too worrying. If that makes sense. So um, if I go on break, that means a I'm either well it could be like any reason that can be go on break. A I'm spending time with a lot of family and friends. B I'm working a lot, and C I uh, just need some time alone to get off the internet world. Quick story time, I went to an anime convention and it was super fun and there was a photo booth for um, taking a picture with guest Pro ZD and I took a picture of Pro ZD at the photo booth and it was like the best thing that has happened. I saw him and I cried which was normal to happen. I'm a very emotional person. Okay, we died together. And yeah, I bought a lot of things, a lot of like Nintendo things, like yeah, like mainly Smash Bros things and miscellaneous. The next assumption actually reminded me that someone said this on Instagram is that I'm an introvert, and yes, that is kind of true. Maybe there are times where I feel like I want to interact with people. There are times where I'm like, no, I don't want to interact with people. It really depends on my mood. How I'm feeling. Like if I'm on a good mood, I'll just not want to interact. But if I'm like a good mood, then I want to talk to someone. Or overall, if like some stranger comes up to me and they think about me while start a conversation, then um, it depends on the on the topic. Like uh, actually, when I was at the convention. Someone came up to me and was like, Oh, are you playing Link? Are you dressing as Link? Because I was like in a Link is Right outfit. And I was like, Yes. And then that started up like a mini conversation. So, overall, am I an introvert? Half and half. Depends on my mood. This guy here, the guy the Red Cliff armor, is currently giving me anxiety. And it's worrying. I, that makes no sense, but I don't care anyways. <laughs> the next assumption that has been made about me, and this is actually pretty quick, and I want to put these together, is like, um, I am still playing Double Beater, or I have quit Double Beater, or I'm quitting Monster Island, and, uh, I'm gonna start with Monster Island, so I am currently taking a long hiatus from the game. Um, because... I just need a long a break from it, and I come back if I'm like bored or something. Um, and I know it's pretty rare for me to like film when Monster Island is like done updating, and I actually I saw a comment something like that. Oh my god, this guy. <laughs> oh no. Where's the new captain? Which one is which? Is it. 
Oh my god, I forgot which one's the noob captain. It's been like long. You'll be feeling on with double beta. I quit a long time ago before I was taken down. I'm not playing the DPX version. I have a full story of why I quit double beta. I'll link it down below to your support team. The next assumption is how people pronounce my username. First of all, I would like to make it clear. It is not Rekka. It is not Rukata. It is Rukatu. Ru -ka -tu. I don't know why it's like complicated, but uh, I mean, I understand my name's a bit complex. Uh, I don't know the origin of it. It's kind of weird because I think it was suggested. That's someone made when I was putting out a poll for usernames that I want to be changed to, and the statue was gonna freaking die. Well, uh, ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we are uh, failed. We have only two chances left. Again! I was saying this, this is give this gave me a lot of anxiety. The next assumption is uh if I'm gonna if I do a webcam or I'm gonna do a face reveal at some point on this channel or anywhere else. I mean that's a pretty good one. I will wanna do a face reveal, but I choose not to face reveal and I or if I'm disappointing anyone out there. The reason why I choose to not face reveal is because, um, first of all, it's for uh, my life private, and I still feel like a Facebook, for example, like to keep it private. Um, second of all, if I did a face reveal, there's gonna be some person out there who's gonna save my photo and then use it to their advantage to catfish other people. That's the thing. I'm like some creepy dude, or creepy woman, or some. And Kill someone's gonna like, use my photo to catfish other people. And I don't wanna be the victim of that. I just want to be safe. And safety, not only on this channel, but anywhere else, is my number one priority. So, no face to feel on this channel. I am super sorry if I disappointed anyone. And that's all I'm gonna say. I just realized this is here now. And now I know why these. Soldiers are here. I thought they were enemies, and now I feel kind of bad for killing them. Fear me, I have the master sword. Actually, funny because I have a master sword in real life, but it's the uh, cosplay version, so it's made out of foam. Because obviously, at an anime convention, you're not allowed to bring real weapons in. Um, and I wanted to buy the master sword for my female two-link cosplay. And I wish I had the shield, but like I want to make it myself. I don't want to buy it because it's expensive. This is the final assumption that I get pretty frequently, and this is why I say please still stay towards the end of the video because this is the biggest assumption I get, and it is that I am a guy who is like dressing as a girl. AKA, um, am I a boy or a girl? Because I am confusing a lot of people, mainly because of how I sound. That's like what I think people why I confuse or like ask me if I'm a boy or a girl. And I just want to clear this up that I am a girl. However, I have a tendency to like things towards uh, that are targeted towards guys. For example, action fighting games. Uh, Shooting games. For example, this game uh, that I I really like this game, and I am a believer that no matter what gender you are, you can like whatever game or activity you like. Whether it's guys liking makeup or girls liking the fandom statue or fandom voices or if it's guys liking Wild High, I believe. That you can be whoever you want. You don't have to be afraid to express your love. If people are gonna like say, "Oh, you shouldn't be doing this because of that gender," then they're wrong. I could go on about this for so long, but I really don't want to take up this video about me uh, rambling on about gender stereotypes. <laughs> And that's 
not the purpose of this video, I guess. Oh no, the statue. Oh, what the heck? This game is giving me a lot of anxiety. And I mean, because okay, is giving me so much anxiety. This is not. Oh my god. And people are us. And people are freaking and insulting me. Well, if I say I'm filming. And that is all for today, I guess. Um. Then thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this kind of clears up everything. If not, then um. I can answer any question in the comments also And thank you guys for watching If you want to play this game I'll link it in the description box down below Somebody please get a win force for this dude Okay, it just gives you bad memories um, And I'll see you guys in the next video Bye